My name is Fraser Wilson. I'm a wildfire behaviour analyst from Forest Fire Management Victoria and I'm also the chair of the Victorian Young Professionals from the Surveying and Spatial Sciences Institute. My job requires me to go across the country to predict bushfires wherever they are. Um, we need to understand where the fires are and where they're going so that we can get that information to communities and to firefighters on the ground. So using GIS we have the ability to work out where fires can start and spread. So if there's a bushfire we're able to do predictions um, that will trigger the warnings that go to your phones and to the radio stations and to the crews so they know where to go and what to do when there's a fire. Ever since I was young I've always been interested in maps um, being a scout, I was really good at navigation and I worked out that I was able to get a career in this. So I studied geospatial science at RMIT University. Studying geospatial science was, is really good. Um, you get to get practical experience, you're out in the field doing some surveying, plus you're in the office playing with computers and other really high-tech stuff that you, know, you don't normally get to use in universities. So I got a job with the department um, working in the region, so I've worked all across Victoria from Traralgon to Bendigo, Mildura, Melbourne, um, doing mapping uh, before specialising in fire behaviour, modelling and prediction. Um, as a fire behaviour analyst, I'm responsible for working out where to place planned burns that we do to reduce the risk to the community. We do that using spatial modelling and prediction, so we know which places that we can do burning that will reduce the risk to communities. While we need to reduce risk to life, properties and communities, we also need to consider the environment. So we put a lot of work into understanding where threatened species are, where they relate to communities, and how we can make sure we're not just uh, protecting communities, but also maintaining a healthy environment. Geospatial is essential in this because we need to know where things are. You know, we can't protect our threatened species if we don't know where they are, what habitats they prefer, and you know, what interaction with fire they'll have by undertaking a planned burn program. We use everything from iPads in the field with surveying software to GPS units from really small ones to really, really expensive ones. Um, all our vehicles have GPS tracking on them. Uh, in the office we have you know, very large computers that do computer modelling, uh, Phoenix Rapid Fire which simulates bushfire. When you're predicting bushfires, it's really rewarding to know that what you're doing is actually making a difference. It's making a difference to the community members who are able to act on that information and protect themselves and for firefighters on the ground who are able to use the information that we're providing through GIS to make their firefighting techniques better. I definitely recommend a career in spatial information um, with new roads, railways, mines, there's just so much going on and demand for graduates is just increasing, not just here but across the world. With all the new technology we need GIS professionals to run them and that could be you 